Good morning. Our presentation will begin in 10 minutes.
morning. Please welcome to the stage, Alex Cho. Well, good morning, everybody. It's great to have you here. And for those of you who are joining online from around the world, welcome. Uh, for those of you who aren't here, let me just tell you one thing about this place. It is hot. I know it is hot, and it's because we are filled with energy and excitement for what we have planned for you today. <laughs> this is a big day. This is a big day, not just for HP, but really it's a big day for our customers. We're going to talk about the importance of our customers and innovation as a part of that. This day, in fact, has been years in the making. Today, we are here to introduce not only a breakthrough new device, but really a new standard in what premium experiences mean for our customers and ultimately the industry. In a few minutes, I'm going to invite Stacy Wolf, who leads design for personal systems, and he's going to be unveiling this amazing device that has been in the works for the past few years. He and his team have doing, I think as you would all agree, an amazing job in elevating design to new levels and really setting the bar for this industry. And as well today, we have Jo Tan. I'm excited that she, who leads product management for our consumer notebooks, will share with you what this device is all about. She has been bold and courageously pushing the innovation envelope so that we can create exciting experiences for our customers. So let me tell you a little bit about how this all began. As you know, Reinvention has been at the core of HP ever since the first days of our company. Bill Hewlett and Dave Packard started in this garage almost 80 years ago in Palo Alto, California. And it's in this garage that innovation was started, sparked, and paved a way for what we know of as HP today and the amazing impact that as a company HP has had. I can tell you, having been a student at Stanford, when I was interviewing for companies, I remember Hewlett Packard, that was a place to go to. That was the place I wanted to work for. And fortunately, after a couple of failed interviews, I was able to join the company. <clears throat> a few years ago, we started to write the next chapter of the innovation story for HP. We doubled down, really, on the spirit of reinvention. It's all about continuing to raise the bar and reinventing. We set out to reinvent the HP brand and to reintroduce the world to a new set of technologies and experiences for the personal computer. We believe that the personal computer was ripe for innovation and also for growth. And we committed ourselves to creating the future of the category. And by the way, the future is all about starting with our customers as our North Star. We started to pay attention even more to customers, to people and places where they were and what they were doing. And for us, this wasn't just about simply chasing speeds and feeds. There's a lot of speeds and feeds in this industry. This is about experiences. This is about elevating innovation so that we can curate an experience that is second to none. And it was about challenging ourselves to continue to reinvent. We at HP are on a mission, and it will go beyond product by product. Our mission is about creating more authentic experiences that reflect who we really are as people. We are on a mission to deliver experiences that are empower people through technology. And we are on a mission to enable people to be really connected not just to their devices, but to other people. And we're very excited about that. <clears throat> I hope you see that we are about something much bigger. We are starting to ask ourselves, how do we create true objects of desire? Not just functionality, but desire. How do we transform the PC into something more than just a computer, but something more personal? We also sought to change the way a PC makes you feel. Devices that aren't, again, simply functional, but are coveted. What a word. That is our ambition, to create experiences and devices that are coveted. 
Technology that evokes emotion and makes a statement. And as we push the envelope on design, we also push the envelope on innovation and technology. The PC has always been a tool for productivity, but with lifestyles continuing to change and work styles continuing to change, we wanted to create technology that adapts to people for what they do throughout the day. We wanted a device that fits people. HP over the past few years has started to make a statement and we have started to raise the bar on what premium is both in our consumer Spectre line, in our commercial Elite Book line, we are studying new standards for what premium experiences mean for our customers. We also redefine the convertible, and I know many of you are enjoying these products that have been setting the bar for what premium convertibles mean for our customers. We also reimagined the all-in-one. Look at that, what a thing of beauty that fits in with your life and the places of your life. Throughout it all, we start to change what people thought of as HP and how people saw HP products and more importantly, the role that our products plays in people's lives. And to be clear, we had our fair share of skeptics. There were many who thought that the PC's best days were behind us. In fact, I put up a quote in here and we left the actual uh, attribution as a mystery. So some of you know who you are on this space. Our teams decided to reject the view that the PC was dead. In fact, what we realized was that the PC needed more innovation and needed reinvention. And so today, HP is a market leader in setting new benchmarks in the industry. We are the fastest growing premium PC vendor in the world. HP Personal Systems is at the heart of a lot of growth and innovation. And again, for us, it is not just about the product, as you can see, it is about our people, and it's about the people and our customers. And I hope this morning, not only you'll see the products and the people behind them, but you will see the passion that drives us in this business. I can tell you, we are just getting started. We are just getting started. There are those who are trying to keep up and catch up, and while that's happening, we are raising the bar once again, and today we are here to tell you about where that bar is as of today, October 1. We are continuing to lead and raise the bar for our customers. This time, we challenged ourselves to do something that had never been done before. We looked beyond conventional PC design conventional boundaries and sought to shatter the mold of what a traditional PC is. This meant once again rethinking everything about the PC. Again, starting with the people who use them and where they use them. It meant imagining a world where exquisite craftsmanship and modern technology seamlessly intersect. Those are two worlds that when you bring them together, bring a thing of beauty. A PC that combines timeless style as well as transcendent technology. We have created something truly special today and I'm so proud to be able to stand before you and introduce for you some of the people behind this amazing product. I've been here at HP for more than 20 years now so I am happy that I joined and that HP accepted me 20, more than 20 years ago. <laughs> And I can tell you, I've never been more proud than I am today of being a part of what we're doing here. This is a great day for us. Again, this is a great day for our customers because we are continuing to bring new experiences for our customers. So Stacy, why don't you come up and show the world what we've been up to? Okay. Thank you, Alex. You know, it's, it's one of those things that this has been an incredible journey. The countless hours our designers and engineers have put forth on this product, it is special. It is one of those things that it kind of sometimes comes once in a lifetime. This is lightning in a bottle. It is something that we are extremely excited to share with you today. Um, we began this journey 
um, just a few years ago, a couple years ago. It was one where we looked to reinvent premium, reset expectations, to create something not just new, but completely new. This is one where we wanted to get to um, a mindset that moved us beyond tradition. Um, we wanted to get to something where the best way to describe this is where modern vintage meets technology. I want you to meet the HP Spectre Folio. This product is gorgeous. It is a product that I think goes beyond almost description. It is a product that really invokes the senses. It is a product that is something that goes far beyond the convertibles that you see in the market today. It's a product that has Basically, no flaws. It goes through so much of your day. It's the most versatile convertible that we've ever made. Now, what I love about this is it's simple yet sophisticated. It's casual yet professional. But for us to go into all the details, let's look at the different positions this convertible can go into. So with this, and I hold it in my hands right now as a simple folio. This is a little bit of retro. This is something where we remember the, the leather wrap in the pad of paper in the pen inside. This is something of history that we've pulled forward. And not only have we done it in such a way where you effectively have, when you open it, that beautiful marriage of modern vintage and technology coming together. It is a product that is a thing of beauty and also a thing of function. This mode is about creation. It does redefine that PC. And what we love about this is it's more than just a laptop. I can move this into its forward position. So what you're able to do is instantly move it from a creation mode to a consumption mode. So whether you're binge watching the movies on a flight or you're surfing to check the scores, it gives you that perfect versatility. So it's the macro involvement that you have with the main screen, but also the micro manipulation that you can have with the touchpad. All of that's available to you. And then what I love the most is that this goes down, simple as that, into a tablet. Now, what I love about this is it actually takes on kind of an iconic relationship of that old favorite paperback book that you would wrap the cover around. Instantly, I can read my favorite book. I can sketch my favorite idea. It is about function married with that beautiful thing of beauty that we have with the new Spectre Folio. Now, the key thing about it is we're changing the conversation. Today in premium, I would say for the most part, we have aluminum has become the standard, almost the gold standard. We measure our premium products by this material. For us, we set out to really kind of reinvent that piece. We actually went to something that was more of what I will call the basics. We call this rock, paper, scissors. This is where basically the designers 
sat together and say, how do we break those rules? Well, let's start at the fundamentals. We know that rock beats scissor. So if that's the case, how do we change it? You change it by the material. We wanted a material that basically had that command of presence, that timeless quality. So whether it is the beautiful leather strap that you have on a watch, or it is the beautiful uh, elements that you have on an automobile that hold it down, or it's that beautiful, if you will, case for that camera. You know, we get to the point here where it is a thing of beauty, but I want to be very clear. This is not a PC that is wrapped in leather. This is a PC that is made of leather. Its function is its binding. The leather that you see on this provides its flexibility, provides its versatility, and it is a luxurious material. Now, there's one more thing. The beautiful cognac brown that I showed you is paired nicely with an ash on the interior. We looked to add a little bit more to that lifestyle. So, for the first time, we're gonna introduce to you Bordeaux Burgundy with luminous gold. It is gorgeous. It sets us forward as we develop these new products where we are now not just measured by that standard, we now move into that lifestyle, that uniqueness, and it is gorgeous. So I think it's important to really kind of say this, and that is that we are super excited about this product. It makes you feel a certain way when you touch it. It makes you feel a certain way when you smell it. It is a product that takes the personal computer to make it truly personal. Now to walk you through the details of the creation of this product, I'm gonna invite Jo Tan to the stage and she'll walk you through. Thank you. Woo! Thank you, Stacy, and good morning, everyone. It's a very exciting day personally for me. We've been working on this product for years, and finally, we're able to share this with all of you. As Alex mentioned at the start, ingenuity and innovation are at the core of HP. That's why I love doing the work that I'm doing. In this case, we set out to push the envelope on technology. The first challenge that we have to overcome is how are you going to develop a device or design a device that is made of 100% genuine leather? So to start, I'm gonna walk you through some of, the, some of the logic, some of the thinking, some of the work that our team put together. We bonded the soft material with a thin magnesium and aluminum frame to assemble all the electronic components. We then integrated the electrical components such as the battery and the touchpad into the soft module. The main components, including the keyboard and the motherboard, is mounted to the soft chassis. The upper chassis is then mounted to the soft chassis module, providing a housing for the motherboard and a frame with a life hinge for the panel. We then mount the panel to the upper chassis, and once it is secure, the, upper, the top of the upper chassis was then mounted to the soft chassis panel section. So what does this mean? Essentially, we are marrying metal and leather into a unified PC. 
This creates the new transformative form factor that Stacy spoke about earlier. As we design and engineer this product, we think about our customers. Our insight told us that many of our customers want a single device that they can use for work and for personal life. They also want to be able to consume and create from many places. And they are looking for an always on, always connected experience. Therefore, we set out and create a device that lasts all day. One that the consumer can carry with them all the time and when they are always on the go, and also a device that they wanted to be always on. With 18 hours of battery life, the HP Spectre Folio excel in this area. And as someone that spent a lot of time on the plane traveling around the world, I can tell you this. This kind of battery performance is a lifesaver. So how do we do that? As you can tell from this picture, we allocated about 70% of the base real estate for battery. Well, this presents another challenge. There is just not enough space for the motherboard. So what do we do? We reach out to our partner, Intel, closely collaborated with them to design one of the smallest motherboard in the industry. The HP Spectre Folio uses the latest Intel 8th gen dual core CPU to deliver responsive performance and yet enable a thin and fanless design. With the HP Spectre Folio, you can also be connected from just about anywhere with ultra fast gigabit class 4G LTE. The HP Spectre Folio is the world first gigabit LTE Intel based laptop that supports up to one gigabit per second download speed. Another benefit for the 4G LTE is security. Built-in LTE means not having to share unsecure public connections. A private connection is a hassle-free way to protect your personal data as well as privacy. So globally, HP Spectre Folio is available on unlock carriers in US and major European countries, with, major, with expansion into Europe and Asia in um, 2019. In the US, the device can be connected to AT&T, T-Mobile, and Sprint. And today, I have a good news for you. For Sprint customers, there is a special promotion offer. Intel and Sprint are offering free six month unlimited data plan on this device. Yes! <laughs> Finally, a special thank you to our partner at Sprint, as well as their network partner, Ericsson who are providing today in-building enhanced LTE coverage for the event. We learned that display quality is also one of the major driver of purchasing behavior. To create a more immersive experience, the HP Folio comes with a 4K touchscreen and the durability of the Corning Gorilla Glass. With 8.2 million pixels, the 4K display is great for watching movie, as well as viewing photos and content. And with 400 needs of display, you, can, you have the ability to view your content both indoor and outdoor. Finally, 
our insight told us that customers are willing to invest more in versatility as well as creative experiences that enable through pen and touch. They are more likely to depend on it for creativity, such as sketching, note-taking, or whiteboarding ideas. Inking is also becoming increasingly important for convertible buyers. 72% of the pen user says pen is the number one satisfaction factor on their devices. That's why we included pen 100% with this device. Along with the self-install pen loop to store your pens when it's not in use. And the pen holder is made of 100% genuine leather that matches the authenticity of the material used on the PC. Plus, as you can see from this picture, with our unique design, it kind of provides the automatic tilt to it for you to have more comfortable inking and typing experience. In every which way you look at it, from premium design to amazing experience to robust performance and versatility, the HP Spectre Folio is one of its kind. A device that has been carefully crafted for modern living, a new breed of technology the PC reinvented. For all of you on the web, I thank you for spending this day with us. For all of you in the audience, we want you to experience this device firsthand. We will direct you to the other side of the venue to share more about the stunning products. With that, thank you very much and have a great day.